This video is presented by VoxPop Marketing Systems. It is an installation guide for your pole mount banner frame, tongue and groove style models with hose clamp style mounting brackets. Here are the tools you will need for your installation. You will need a measuring tape, a large flathead screwdriver or a power driver with a 7 16 inch socket head driver bit and a pair of shears and your installation instructions. Here are the parts included with your frame. You have your live and dead end tongue and groove style arms which grip and hold the banner. You have your top and bottom brackets. You have three hose clamps to attach the brackets to the pole and the tension screw for winding the banner tight. Before we get started, here's a quick overview of how to attach the brackets to the pole using hose clamps. Insert the clamp into the slot into the bracket as shown. The white plastic stop in the bracket should be facing outward. Then insert the clamp into the worm gear. Pull it tight around the pole as shown here. Fold the worm gear back so it engages the clamp and then simply screw tight with your screwdriver or with your power driver. Cutting off the excess clamp with a pair of shears will make your finished display more attractive. The first step in the installation process is measuring for your brackets. Most likely using a ladder, make a mark on the pole where you want the top of your display to go. This will be the top of the top bracket. Then measure down your banner height plus two inches. This will be the bottom of where you install your bottom bracket. Beginning with the smaller top bracket as shown here, make sure the stop is facing outward and then attach it to the pole with the hose clamp as shown. We recommend you do this on the ground level and then attach the hose clamp loosely, then slide it up to the spot where you made your mark previously. Now tighten the hose clamp securely. Here is a photo of the top bracket properly attached to the pole. To attach the bottom bracket, begin with one hose clamp as shown here. Insert it through the bracket, loosely attach it to the pole, and position it at your mark. Now you want it tightened, but not completely just yet. Before fully tightening, line up the bottom bracket with the top bracket so that they are on the same vertical plane. Then tighten the hose clamp. Once the first hose clamp is tight, add the second hose clamp and tighten it as shown here. If desired, snip off the excess. Here is a photo of your completed bottom bracket. Your pull mount brackets are now installed and you're ready to install the banner on them. Begin by laying your banner out and place the dead end arm, which is labeled, with the glide facing up at the top of the banner as shown. Then place the live end arm at the bottom of the banner as shown. To attach the banner to the arms, Begin by removing the plastic dowel from the arm as shown and insert it into the pole pocket into the banner. Then insert the banner with the dowel into the groove into the arm as shown here. and repeat this process for the bottom arm. Now 
Once the arms are attached to the banner, you want to begin with the dead end or top arm, fold its back so that its glide inserts into the top of the top bracket. Let it hang loose. Then fold the bottom arm under and insert its glide into the bottom bracket as shown here. Pull it down. Then take your tension screw and insert it through the white plastic stop as shown until it engages the threaded glide in the bottom arm. Once done, simply wind until the banner becomes very tight. Your display is now complete and should appear as shown here. Front shot and a rear shot. If you have any questions or problems with this installation, please call us at 800-3-VOXPOP to speak with a live representative.